Welcome back to Community Cafe. Joining us now is Don Diamond, president of Leesburg Food Bank. Welcome to the show, Don. How are you doing today? I'm doing great, thank you. Can you share with me a little bit of the brief history of the Leesburg Food Bank? The Leesburg Food Bank started in 1985 from a small building down by Romac Lumber. Later, they moved to Sunshine Avenue at 1305, and I joined them in uh, about 20, uh, 19 years ago anyways. I've been there and I went as a one day volunteer and within within a month I was president of the food bank. You were stuck there. <laughs> and I've been trying to get out for 15 years. Can't make it yet. You're never leaving. You're stuck there now. <laughs> There'll be the day that buyers comes after me and I'll be out. <laughs> <laughs> well, sometimes food banks and food drives can get pretty confusing. Can you share with us exactly what a food bank is? A food bank is a place where people that are in need come to get supplementary food. Now we don't feed them for a whole month. We give them about a three, three to five days of food when they come. Uh, we give them all the nourishing. We give them meat. We give them fresh meat, vegetables, canned goods, non-perishable food. We try to we try to really give them enough to. They could make it go a week if they wanted to. Wow. Yes. And you said you've been at the food bank for 19 years. And at the food bank, what is your job there? Like, what does your job entail? Try to go out and procure as much food as I can. I've uh, got in touch with uh, a lot of dispatchers. I get food from trucking companies now. If they have a pallet or two left over, they bring it directly to the food bank and get out to as many community organizations as I can to get them, encourage them to draw, do a food drive for us. Seems like a fun job. Do you enjoy it? I did until this year, and I've had a lot of health problems, so I haven't enjoyed it as much as I have in the past. But every time I ask them to find somebody else, they say, no, you're doing all right. <laughs> <laughs> well, what are some of the specific needs of the food bank right now, and what community organi organizations would you say you work with? Well, the most need right now, right now in our stock, I probably have enough food on the shelves to go about three weeks. And if it doesn't start coming in again at a fairly decent rate, we'd have to cut our hours even more. And uh, my, like I say, my job is to go out and try to get people to uh, do it. We have Publix is a great supporter of the Leesburg Food Bank. and. Uh, there are many others, are too many to really name off, but there are a lot of nice people out there, especially our retirement communities in the area, they do a great job. When they're gone for the summer, we suffer. But when they're back, they're great donors. Wow. Um, what are some ways that people can help support the food bank? <clears throat> they can support the food bank with cash donations, or they can have food drives. Yeah. We, we can buy a lot of the different food that we need, probably be cheaper than you could buy it. <laughs> That's true. Right? Mm -hmm. Well, thanks, Don. I look forward to working with you in the Miss Leesburg Annual Food Drive. We're going to be collecting food all February and then delivering it to you. Well, this project is important to me because the first time that I went to the food bank over spring break, it was really important to me to see how everybody just worked together, and that was inspiring to see how well they made it a smooth operation. Well, that's. We thank you very much for that, and we like having the young people come to the food bank because they get a better idea of what goes on at a food bank mm -hmm. and the need for help people yes. to help us. And thank you so much, Don, for coming in and sharing your story with us. We appreciate all the work you do for the Leesburg Food Bank. For more information on the Leesburg Food Bank, please visit the website below. Thank you for joining us for another episode of Community Cafe, your daily dose of inspiration with community exploration. We will see you next time. Bye. Um, I'm so excited for Chick-fil-A. <laughs>